Use place value to add part 2, lesson 8.7b. Now you need to see the video before this one, 8.7. You need to see that first. And there's a link in this video's description so you can click and go back and watch it if you haven't seen it yet. We have learned to use models to help us add two-digit numbers. We can use place values to add or subtract. Here we have an addition problem. We see the plus sign, so we know it's addition. 25 plus 12. We can use the place values, the ones place and the tens place, to help us add these two-digit numbers. We start in the ones place. We always start in the ones place first. We add the 5 plus 2. 5, 6, 7. We write our answer, the sum, down below it in that place value. Then we add the tens. 2 plus 1 more is 3. That means 25 plus 12 has a sum of 37. What we did was we had 25, two tens, and five ones, and we had 12, that's one ten and two ones, and we put them together. We put the ones together, we put the tens together, so we had 30, 5, 36, 37. Let's try it again. We have 41 plus 13. Add the ones together first. We have a one plus a three. Start with the larger add in three and add on three, four. So we have a four in the ones place. Then we add the numbers in the tens place. We have a four plus a one. That's four and one more is five. So we know that 41 plus 13 has a sum of 54. Let's try it again. Here we've got 34 plus 5. We add the 1's, 4 plus 5. We can start with the 5 and count on 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We also could have used doubles plus 1, couldn't we? We could have said 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 1 more for the 5 makes a 9. There's nothing to be added in the tens place, except we, we, the only thing we have is this 3. So because there's no number here, we just drop the 3 down. See? It's not being added to anything. The 5 is just 5 ones. So there's no tens here. We just bring the 3 down. So we know that 34 plus 5 is equal to 39. See that? Let's try another one. We have 59 plus 20. We have 5 tens and 9 ones plus 2 tens and 0 ones. We start with the ones place first and we add 9 plus 0. And you remember whenever we add 0 to a number, the number stays the same. So the 9 is going to stay the same and we're going to have a 9 in the ones place. In the tens place, we have a 5 plus a 2. We can start with the 5 and count on 2, 5, 6, 7. That means 59 plus 20 is equal to 79. Let's try another one. We have 27 plus 62. 27 plus 62. That means we have two tens and seven ones, and we're going to add six tens and two ones. We start in the ones place with the larger add in seven, we count on two, seven, eight, nine. In the tens place, we start with the larger add in six and count on the two, six, seven, eight. This means 27 plus 62 is equal to 89. Let's try one more. We have 30 plus 28. 30 plus 28. We start with the ones place. We have zero ones and eight ones. Eight plus zero, whenever we add zero to a number, the number stays the same. So the eight is going to stay the same. In the tens place, we add the three tens and the two tens. 
3 plus 2 is equal to 5, we have 58. 30 plus 28 is equal to 58. Now we can also use place values to subtract. If we have 56 and we want to take away 14, 56 minus 14, we have 5 tens and 6 ones, and we want to take away and subtract 1 ten and 4 ones. We start with the ones place. We have 6, we want to take away 4, we can count back 2, 6, 5, 4, we took away 2. 5, take away 1, 5 tens take away 1 ten, would leave 4 tens. So we know 56 minus 14 is equal to 42. Here we have 38 minus 15. We have three tens and eight ones, and we want to take away one ten and five ones. We start in the ones place. We have eight, and we want to take five away. We can start with eight and count back to five. Eight, seven, six, five. That's three. We can also start with the five and count up to the eight. Five, six, seven, eight. That gives us three. So we know it's definitely a three. Now we have three tens, and we want to take away one ten. Three minus one is two. So we know that 38 minus 15 is equal to 23. The difference between 38 and 15 is a 23. We're going to continue on talking about two-digit addition and subtraction in Lesson 8.8, .8, and I hope I'll see you there. Keep practicing your addition and subtraction facts, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.